I got this cute air freshener and uh, it cost me fucking ten dollars it's supposed to smell like candy apple and it's adjustable or whatever glow in the dark but it does not smell like candy apple at all it has like no scent so I'm kind of pissed off about that I wish there was a different color aside from this gross orange around it but I guess it's all right it's kind of cute but very disappointing as far as the smell goes and Logan convinced me to get this cool Doctor Who calendar it's got some awesome pictures on it I don't know if I can rotate it but I really really like the pictures on it especially January I think that's really cool and he got me this little Jigglypuff velour kind of uh, coin purse, which I won't use it because my makeup bag, my purse is always dirty with makeup, but it's really soft and really, really cute. I also found these little skull candles. There's a black one and a red one. These are from our cheap Asian shop. So these were like, I don't know, $3 each. Or three fifty each. Um, they don't smell like anything, but they're they were all right. They were kind of cute. There's the only black one in the store. They had other colors, but that quickly adds up. So I only got two. I found this really adorable bear at the clothing warehouse for three dollars. His head's really wonky. It doesn't really stay on, but his coloring. I thought was quite unique. He's very striking and so I figured out oh, I'll just have him sit there and I won't move. I won't move him and he'll be alright. I also got this bear. Um, this is a really cool bear. He's obviously handmade so they won't. there won't be any other like him. He's got buttons for arms and for legs and he's made of this weird, I don't know, the material is, is it's also kind of velour, but it's a bit rougher. And, um, yeah, he's, he's a little heavy, considering he's itty bitty. His stitches aren't perfect, but, um, yeah, he's very obviously handmade. And I just thought that was kind of cool to have, like, somebody's hard work. <laughs> handmade um, one-of-a-kind bear. Logan says that it kind of looks like the bear that you'd see on like an anime, horror anime or something, so I agreed that was pretty cool. And then he's a he's a deep burgundy color, which is pretty pretty fitting, I think. So yeah, he's adorable. You guys might have seen pictures of me in this. I also got this at the clothing warehouse. Um, this was not $3, so they have a section of higher priced items. And this was there along with a gorilla mask. But of course, you know, for our, should be obvious reasons, I liked this one. And um, this was $9.50. But it is pretty cool. It's pretty detailed and it makes for some really artistic photos, especially when I pair it with a white wig, which is what I did when I took some photos. I probably put a couple of photos in here so you can see what it looks like with the wig underneath. And I got this. I got this at the same time that I got the um, the calendar. And uh, this was on sale as well. So it's pretty cool. It's a, it's a diary obviously, like a um, scheduler, which I won't fill it out because I don't have anything that I schedule in or book in but it's got pictures and then it talks about the episodes and uh, yeah is that gonna focus it's not gonna focus leave it to my phone not to focus anyway so yeah it's uh it's really interesting and I haven't read through it yet. I started to. 
but I haven't finished it. And I thought this was quite a good find because um, it's really, really interesting and makes me want to just go back and watch the show again because I'm impatient waiting for it to start up again. And then Logan got me this hooded, this really soft hooded beach towel. And I, of course, couldn't take it out of the package in the store. You can only kind of feel it and see the design. So I fell in love with it. And I, like, I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And I got it. And then it turns out it's a fucking poncho. So it's not necessarily a beach towel. It's a fucking poncho. So I will never wear that. I am not going to walk around in a poncho. As you can see, it opens up. And it's a poncho, unfortunately. But... It is really cool. It's, you know, it's got the skeleton face on it and goes down like that. And it's got the print on both sides. <clears throat> it's pretty heavy. And, uh, yeah, I just don't know what they were thinking. I thought it was just like a flat towel with, um, with a hood on it, but not, not something like this. And I, I don't want to cut it or anything because then I'll just ruin it. But, uh, it's nice, I guess, just have laying around for now. Um, at the clothing warehouse, he also showed me this and told me I should get it. Uh, if you're on my Facebook, you'd know half of this stuff because I always post everything on Facebook. But um, it's this like little mini dress. Let me see if I can... That's better. Uh, it's a little mini dress and as you can see, it's got Egyptian print all over it. It's got pockets and um, it laces up in the back. This is the back of it. And there's no tag in it, so a lot of people are telling me that they think it's probably homemade. A lot of people were saying that they thought it was homemade because they said that they've never seen anything like this before. But I've seen dresses in this style, just maybe not this print. But when I mean, there's so many, many prints in the world, you can't assume to have seen them all, you know. Um, I'll put a picture uh, here. And it's cute and everything, but right now it is way too short. And I personally think that the cut of it is very unflattering for me. So I won't be wearing it, but it was $3 and it's, you know, it's Egyptian. <laughs> I also got this dress from the clothing warehouse. This is $3 as well. And uh, I'll put a picture here. So, um, this here has elastic at the top to hold it up. It's a bit see-through, so I've got to work around that. And it's got this built-in belt. Very figure flattering. I really love this dress. Like, I thought this was a pretty good find. I was scared I wouldn't fit into it, but it fit me perfectly. So, that's really nice. <laughs> I really like that. Um... I went to like one of those cheapy Asian stores yesterday and I got a set of these rings. Uh, this is PowerShell if you're not from here. Um, it's like the like New Zealand shell. It's probably of course fake because it's from a, it was three dollars, but uh, it's not gonna focus. Um, let's see if I can turn the light on it. Because it, it has this white film here at the bottom when I hold my phone case. So it's really hard to try not to wash it out. There you go. See how pretty that is? So that's a power shell. And yeah, it was three bucks, but it should be alright if I take it off before I shower and stuff. So I thought that these rings were really nice because... My fingers have shrunk, so no, none of my rings really fit anymore. And uh, I'm pretty sure lastly is the best. Uh, Logan like didn't give me a choice as far as buying this went. He's like, you will buy this. And I was quite happy because it is adorable. I saw it and I was like, oh my fucking god, I really love this shirt. I didn't want to show out the money for it because this was really expensive. I don't ever spend this much on my clothes, like not t-shirts, never, never, ever, ever. Uh, it was 
but um, there was only two in the store, and one was an XL, and then this one's a medium, and it's from Dark Side, and yeah, it says the number of the beast, and it's got this adorable kitty cat on it, and so I just, it was a must buy, I thought that was the cutest shit ever. And so, yeah, I got that. And um, as far as I know, that's my mini haul for this month. I didn't include, you know, the stuff that I got to review. Oh, wait, one more thing. Um, or the gifts I was given. So these are only just little things that we picked up, mostly, you know, from the clothing warehouse. I also got this headband. Uh, I use, like, headbands when I do my makeup, put my hair back and stuff, and... This is just a cheapy $3 thing as well, but it's got little gems on it that obviously are very sparkly, and I just thought this was really cute, so I picked it up, and I wore it out all day yesterday under a hood to keep my wig on, because I had my wig and it was windy outside. But yeah, um, aside from that, that's pretty much all we got that I know of. If there's anything else, I'll added in but I highly doubt it and um, sorry there's not much but we don't you know go around spending money usually um this was just like the coolest thing so I got that and the other things were like three bucks it's not a big deal the um skeleton blanket and the doctor who stuff was earlier in the month um but I haven't done like a haul video in a while so I was just like oh, I'll just throw it in there and stuff for fellow Whovians and uh, yeah that's about it for now and I'll see you guys hopefully we'll have uh, a better haul video coming up at some point